gamma from start. Those are those big windows. Hey, look, it's a rhino hose, the non leak type. That's important. And the bike setup. We're walking around. Walking around. See the two big slides. And then um, right over here we have the, uh, the low rider. I don't know if you can see it in the, come out in the sun. I don't know if you can see that or not, but his wheels are off the ground. La Bamba style. All right. Here. All right. So this is Gamma, and that's diet food right there. This is the upstairs bunk, I guess, the overhead. That's Maddie. There's that. Look, I just found this out. This is so cool. Look, watch. Ready? This is neat. It's got instant on lighting. I-O-L. Every place should have that. Look, watch. I-O-L in action. Amazing. I-O-L. Instant on lighting. Genius. All right. So anyway, this is the... Uh, the galley or a kitchen, I don't know, should I use nautical terms or should I just use regular terms? But anyway, this is the kitchen. Um, there's a stove. There's a microwave. There's some blinds. There's the refrigerator right here. Right? And see, look. I'm camping. There's a problem. There's no beer, but there's milk. And creamer that... I, I don't know who puts creamer in a coffee, but that's killing coffee, so that's illegal. Um, so there's that, um, and then those little holes right there, that's for another table. So we're going to walk back here and there's the trash can. Those are the jacks that we're using right now to, to stabilize the coach. And, uh, it is so much better. Oh my God. These, and then here's the bathroom. There's some more IOL, right? IOL. And then, um. I, I, I kind of hid my double chin there, so that was okay. And then we have some storage here, right? Hair dryer. We got a big old eye fit in there. So you know that's cool. Um, story, or that's not storage. Well, it could be storage, but it's not. It's a shower. Um, shower head works all right. I need to change it out. There's some stuff I need to do to her. Um, trash can. The throne. And then here's the cool part. Check this out. So you open this up. Bam! Bedroom. It's on a slide. That's a slide right there. Um, nice big storage right here. More storage. Even comes with a desk. Look at that. 12 volt DC. I can put an inverter in there. Like that one right there. Um, and then here's my cable hookups are back here somewhere. Right, and another 12 volt right there. So I got two 12 volts. I can hook up my inverter, um, so I can uh, run stuff while I'm uh, DC camp and slide control right there. Pocket door. So basically, I can shut this off right here. This shuts, and then you can use this door right here to go into the the wash closet or whatever you call it in France. Um, and then this way over here she's 33 feet and then, and then um tv uh dvd player i i don't know what all those buttons do but they look expensive and fun uh, and then we have the um the tanks right here so main battery or aux battery main i got my uh my propane my black tank my gray tank and my fresh water uh, water pump which is off right now because I'm hooked up to the city water uh, my water heater which I will turn on um, and just let that go boom it just it just clicked on so now we have hot water in the coach and um, spice rack and stuff right there dual sinks I mean it's a nice coach it really is so anyway that's the tour of the uh, coach here that we're uh, we bought 
lot of fun. Uh, next month, I we have camping on the beach. We're going to be three feet from the ocean. I will send vids on that. Hey, it's Papa Drew. Hey, you know, everybody wants to hang flags off of their RV, right? Who wants to spend 150 bucks for a flag? I mean, I'm patriotic as the next person, but who wants to hang a flag on their RV and spend $150 to do it? So I looked and I looked and I looked and I couldn't find a better replacement to do that. I found some for 40, 50 bucks, but you know, American Ingenuity is awesome. So 10 bucks, here's what you do. Couple hose clamps. Right here. See it? And you go get yourself some couple of Walmart poles. They even come with the flags. 20 bucks. You're done. You got a flag pole right there. And it's been going in about 15, 20 knots of wind, and it's still up there working. So if you want to save yourself some money, put a flag up, show patriotism, whatever you want to hang off your coach. Um 20, 20 bucks and you too can have a flag that looks halfway decent, I think. I don't know, if you find something cheaper or better, let me know. Papa Drew 